Hey everybody, it's Andy Agostini back again uh, to talk a little bit more about the EA UHL. Uh, just wanted to give you a quick idea of how to apply these uh, contract cards and training cards on your players to make your team uh, improve and, and standard the salary cap. Uh, one of the, the quickest things to do is just by selecting a player, and you'll see an icon whether you're an Xbox or a PS3 user, you'll see an icon that you can actually select a player and you'll see all the different things you can do with him. Uh, applying a consumable will allow you to put either a contract card, and as you can see I have a bunch here that I can put on a guy, or a training card. And up on top you'll actually see the difference of, uh, you know, your defense is a rating 61, but with this card it'll be plus 9, and the new rating will be 70. So it explains everything before you actually do anything with the card. I'll apply this card to this uh, 2 way forward here. And now he has 70 defense, and it shows that he's actually improved to a 60 overall. Um, and then if I want to put a contract card on him, I can place a contract on him, and now he has 27 games ready to go for your team. You don't even have to worry about him for quite a while now. So just a quick uh, example of how you're going to be managing your team as you, as you play in the EA UHL. Uh, all these cards are used by everybody, and now that we've actually put a, a training card on him, you can see that he's used one of his 10 training slots. So it lets you see that uh, not everyone's going to get to 99. You'll have to manage your cards well, and uh, good luck in finding those special rare training cards.